in the heavens. And the Bible says God created heaven is and earth. How can someone live in heaven created heaven? How possible? Is it possible for you to build your own house? The Bible is full of contradiction. Then I'm just asking you a question. Is it possible for you to build your own house? Bro. <laughs> Come and prove me wrong. I will prove me wrong. Come and prove me wrong, brother. Yeah. This is the book of Psalms, hey, chapter 14 and verse 1. Hear this. Listen. The fool has said in his heart, there is no God. The fool has said in his heart, there is no God. Hey, listen. Go ahead. They are corrupt. They have done abominable works. There is none that doeth good. There is none that doeth good. The fool said in his heart, there is no God. None do good. Come on, man. What's your, what's, your, what's, your, what's, your, what's your belief? There's no God? Is there no God or is the Bible false? Listen to my question and answer. I said I'm proving you wrong, so you have to listen to me. You don't have to say what you want to switch you. But you just got to Hold on, man. Get Acts 5 and 29, I, man. You know, get Acts 5 and 29. You read you what get Acts 5 and 29. We're not going to listen to your foolishness, man. No, no, get Acts 5 and 29. Bro, I'm going to show you who we're going to listen to. Hold on. I'm going to let you speak. I'm going to let you speak. Get that's, Acts 5 and 29. That's the book of Acts chapter 5, verse 29. Look, you know, pray, pray. You wrong. Then Peter and the other apostles answered and said, we ought to obey God rather than men. We ought to obey God rather than men. But let me prove you wrong. Listen to me, bro. Go ahead, bring up what you got to say, bro. I said, read first Genesis chapter 1, verse 1. Read first Genesis chapter 1, verse 1. Go ahead, bring up what you got to say, bro. Genesis chapter 1, verse 1. Read first Genesis chapter 1, verse 1. 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 Genesis chapter 
I'm not God. Oh, right. Hey, right. come here. Right. 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 That's the whole point. Man. Right. 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 Where are you from, brother? Where are you from? It doesn't matter where I'm from. I'm proving it. Yes, it does matter where you're from. Where are you from? It doesn't matter where you're from. But you haven't proven anything. You haven't proven anything. You've proven that you don't know the Bible. Right. What do you oh, think that you oh, can, let me ask hey, you, this. you let me think ask we you. were created by a big bang? No, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. So how do we let get me it? Ask, let me ask you this. I came as this time through my mother and my father. They have intercourse and they give birth. And who me. created them? Who? Who created them? Who created them? They are father and mother. They give birth to them. <laughs> so how, okay, how did it all start? Yeah. All how did it all start? Right. Perfect. Now you're asking a perfect and right. question. <laughs> you have to calm down. Let me screw no. you. Well, you got to calm down. The Bible is full of mystery. The Bible is full of misinterpretation, misunderstanding, misinterpretation. Because you listen to Christians. That's why you got. You, hey, Israelite, you know what it is? You preach what suits you. The, no, Bible, the no. pastors speak, preach what suits you. That's not true. No, we no. don't teach. We don't teach. We, why? We teach why? Us. Why is it the pastor is preaching the kingdom of God? Okay, me, I don't want to go to hey. God. Why, do, why don't you die? You, you know why you don't it? get it? Because he revealed his secrets to oh, the prophets. Oh, you are lost. That's it. Is. You are lost. You, you're right. Where are you from? Do you tell me where you're from? Become a where are you from, brother? And you know where I'm talking about. Come on, man. Come on, here. Become a free thinker. <laughs> I'm proving you. Yeah, you need to repair, <laughs> brother. Huh? God I can't. Give it wisdom to bro. 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 That's one and four. Yeah. Did you look at that man kingdom? Did you see the way that he will follow? He followed the prayer. Hey, 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 so that's, that's the Bible doesn't have there's power. No, the power no is power. in the word of there's God. No power in there. hey, yeah. Keep going, man. There's For no forward thoughts separate from God oh, and no his power. power. When it is tried, reprove it. The unwise... For into a malicious soul wisdom shall not enter, that's right. nor dwell in a body that is subject yeah. unto sin. Yeah. That, that brother, he's, he, he lives in sin, right. so therefore he can he's never get the wisdom of the Lord. You know what I'm saying? He's uh, one of those, uh, he's a free thinker. Yeah. So, yeah, so let, him, let, him, let him think freely while all the way to hell. All the way to destruction. Uh, hey, that day's going to come where you're going to bow to him and you're going to regret it. <laughs> You're giving the, your ancestors, but guess what? Our God created your ancestors. That's right. That's right. Let me tell you this. Let me tell you this. The white man who brought the Bible to us, he's serving our ancestors and the scattered and the church. That's what they're here for. What? What the fuck? The white man brought the Bible to Africa and he's serving our ancestors and the dad said, and they stretch out the bread. They're like, and you are this, this, is, this is the book of Ezekiel, chapter 2, verse 7. And thou shalt speak oh, my words unto them, whether they will hear or whether they will forbear. That's what he's For they are most rebellious. Uh -huh. no, bro, You're a rebellious bro, bro, child, man. Bro, bro, you don't want to hear. Your your age one fact. The most high has shut your eyes and your ear to hear, man. Bro, That's right. You know why? Because you're open. in the midst of sin, brother. You got open. spirits on you, my brother. You need to repent, brother. Me. You need to repent, keep the commandments, you and come to back to, to the most high, man. Want to go to heaven, right? Yeah, that's right. I'm, hey, Lord willing, I'm not going to boast. Lord willing, the most high is going to have you up there. All right, all right. This is the book of Romans, chapter 3, verse 3. For what if some did not believe? Right. Shall their unbelief make the faith of God without effect? God forbid, yeah, let God be true, but every man a liar. Let God be true, and every man a liar. Brother, repent, repent, or you're going to likewise perish. Precept, um, Second Thessalonians two eleven. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yo, yeah, demons on them. Well, the words were bothering me from far. <laughs> repent, repent, or likewise perish, brother. Oh, I got this a perfect one. This is book of Second Thessalonians chapter two verse eleven. And for this cause. God shall send them strong delusion, delusion that, that they, they should believe, believe a lie. lie. That they all might be damned 
who believe in not the truth, but have pleasure in unrighteousness. Have pleasure in unrighteousness. He gonna probably go to his crib now, and go slide up a split, yeah. smoke it. And Bible, and Bible people are thinking that a, like a piece of, like a book actually has any power. It's the word of God that has the power. That's right. It just happens to be reside yeah. within the Bible. <laughs> He's, he's, a, he's a man that just has no understanding. No, no understanding, that's right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the most high took that away from him. him man. The most high took that wisdom that's away from him. That's prophecy so, right there. That's right. That let that let us know that. That we shouldn't be uh, forsaking the most high. Because he can make us be like him. Yeah, we can lose that Not believe in God. Not that's believe right. that there's a God in this world. Not believe that there's a creator that's getting ready to, to destroy this world. We, and we're here trying to help that brother. Trying to tell him to repent, keep the commandments and the faith. But what was his words? There's no God. God isn't true. Hey, the Bible contradicts itself. Why? Because you got lack of wisdom. My people, that's perfect. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Right there. That's right. That's right there. That's right. Read, brother. This is the book of James, chapter 2 and verse 17. That's right. Even so faith, if it had not words, is dead, being alone. Yea, a man may say, thou hast faith, and I have words. Show me thy faith without thy words, and I will show thee my faith by my words. That's right. Thou believest that there is one God, mm -hmm. thou doest well. That's right. The devils also believe and tremble. That's right. But wilt thou know, O vain man, that faith without works is dead? That's right. Faith without works is dead, people. Uh, he believe in, in Don't go thinking what your pastor told you is true. That's right. That all you do is have to have faith. That's right. You could go many times in the Bible. It tells you book from, from, from even the end of the book, Revelations. It tells you. As a matter of fact, go to Revelations on huh? 22 and 14. Yeah, get it. You start off at 12. <laughs> start off at 12. Come, come, come. That's right. You got to keep these commandments and the faith in your house shot. We're not saying it's easy. We're not perfect. We all committed sin. We all fallen short of the glory of God. Hey, but the Most High is long suffering. He cares about us. He's willing to suffer for us that we don't perish. But we're stiff-necked, hard-headed people. We're wise to do evil, but to do good, we have no knowledge. That's, right. That's our people. That's right. We don't want to listen to God. But when that judgment comes, that fear, anger of the Lord, that's when you're going to be on your knees crying, God, please forgive me. I won't do it anymore. But it's too late. But it's too late. It's like that song. It's too late, baby. It's too late. Yeah, that's what it is. It's going to be too late for you, my man. God, God. Because when I called, you refused. When I stretched out my hands, you knocked it over. You disregarded his word. Bring that precept up, brother. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 22 and verse 12. And behold, I come quickly. He's coming quickly. And my reward is with me. To give every man according as his work shall be. No, according to the faith that he has. According as his work shall be. And because you got faith, you're going to do what he says. That's, right. That's where faith and works is. I believe in Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai. I'm going to keep his commandments. That's why his true prophets are out here week in and week out waking up our people, telling them to repent or you're going to likewise perish. That's right. Verse 19, I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. Blessed are they that do his commandments. No, blessed are they that keep the faith in God. Blessed are they that do his commandments that they may have right to the tree of life and may enter in through the gates into the city. That's right. Let me get the book. Let me get this system. This is going to happen, sis, when the Most High comes. We're suffering now. We all go through problems. Financial illnesses, all these kinds of problems we're having. We have families that are dying. We suffer a lot. We're being oppressed twice, sis, because we disobeyed our Heavenly Father. That's right. And this is our punishment. But he promised us he's not going to forsake us. 
He just wants us to turn back to him. And the Bible says, in that time, we're going to bethink ourselves. We're going to think, hey, man, we're doing wrong. We are going to have to keep these commandments and this faith in the Most High. And we're going to come back to serving the Lord like he wanted us to. Let me get the book of Revelation 21. I think you start off at... Let me see. Start off at 3. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 21, of verse 3. That's right. And I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, Behold, the tabernacle of God is with men. No, the tabernacle of God is only for women. The tabernacle of God is with men. The tabernacle of God is with men. It behooved you sisters to find a man of the Lord. Because when these bad times are coming, you're going to regret not having one. That's right. That's right. Oh, especially these lesbians, man. That's right. They're going to regret because they're dark final. That's one of the most high's weapons. The book tells you the book of Sirach 39. Spirits it tells you their spirits made for vengeance. Mm -hmm. The most high, Alan Shajia, terrible demon like powers, is getting ready to judge this world. That's what he's getting ready to do. Read. Yeah, and I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, "Behold, the tabernacle of God is with men, mm -hmm. and He will dwell with them, and they shall be His people, and God Himself shall be with them, That's right. and be their God. That's right. And God shall wipe away all tears from their eyes, and there shall be no more death, neither sorrow mm -hmm. nor crying, neither shall there be any more pain." For the former things are passed away. That's right, right there. The former things are going to be passed away. That's right. In a twinkling of an eye, he's going to give us new bodies. He's going to wipe the tears away from our eyes. He's going to wipe the pain. He's going to take that pain away. There's not going to be no more war. That's what's going to happen when the Most High comes. But. Before he comes, he's already giving you the sign, which he's getting ready to open the doors. We have to repent. Forsake your sins. Turn back to the mold of time. Keep the commandments and the faith and his only begotten son, Yahawashah, who you ignorantly call Jesus. Let's wake up, Israel. The Most High is coming. This is your brother Shaopa. Rise of the Chosen and Worcester Mass. Find us in the YouTube um, fa um, page book, on uh, Facebook or Facebook and YouTube. So, heck yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, that dude was funny, right? <laughs> What about what he said? When I kept asking him, who created you? But who created your parents? <laughs> he said the obvious. He said what, the obvious. Did we just come out of a bleak of the air? <laughs> Man, do you know how complex the brain works? For the brain to work, all your typical types of bodies works your eyes? You think that that came from a big bang? No, that came from a power that's just way out of our minds man that's right that's, yeah. that's where it came from man these people are wicked man that's why the most high is going to destroy these people man that's right you can oh. mock go ahead, go they ahead, can go ahead. mock the men of the lord but that day is coming israel that's right, that's that right. Day is all coming. praises to the most high your heart brought shine. that's my brother pa shout pa bring it out there all fire. praise all praise in front of the dental building in worcester mass on main street y'all can come out here and see us lord willing every saturday from 2 p.m until or you can go to our YouTube channel, which is um, Rise of the Chosen Worcester, or you can check us, or you can uh, make sure you like, subscribe, share, and hit the little notification bell for when we mm -hmm. upload new content. Um, you also can uh, check us out on Facebook at The Rise of the Chosen. That's right. You know, we have a powerful ministry that we're trying to bring the Lord's word out in truth and sincerity. With that being said, we're going to give our closing prayer. Uh, from the book of Psalm chapter 19, we start with verse 7. This is the book of Ch Psalm chapter 19, verse 7. The law of the Lord is perfect, 
converting the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, make it wise and simple. The statutes of the Lord are right, rejoice in the heart. The commandment of the Lord is pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean, enduring forever. The judgments of the Lord are true and righteous altogether. Moreover, to be desired are they than gold, yea, than much fine gold, sweeter also than honey and the honeycomb. Moreover, by them is thy servant warned, and in keeping of them there is great reward. Who can understand his errors? Cleanse thou me from secret faults. Keep back thy servant also from presumptuous sins. Let them not have dominion over me. Then shall I be upright, and I shall be innocent from the great transgression. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my redeemer. Kwam Yasharala. That's my time. My name is Akwayan. My brother Shah Park. We are rising right. chosen ministry. Rise of the chosen. That's our time. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.